So we know that many stormed and breached the Capitol just days ago, and then they traveled afar. They were on airplanes, and some were arrested when they arrived at airports. One person was arrested as far away as Hawaii. And there are many examples of travel, and we have seen online, and the authorities have seen online, desires to come back to Washington and to go to other places to cause more trouble and more violence. And there are many examples of this kind of travel. There are many examples of this kind of travel. So, here we are today, and we are concerned about these people getting back on airplanes and doing more violence. And so he today, ahead of a concern for, ahead of the concern for possible future attacks, and with the law on our side, we are to say that these insurrectionists, many of whom are known to be at large, should not be able to hop on a flight. We are today, we are here today because the folks, the people, the insurrectionists who breached the U.S. Capitol fall under the definition of threats to the homeland and should be immediately added to the TSA no-fly list. We are calling on the authorities, the FBI, the TSA, any of those who are inside the Capitol should be placed on the no-fly list and not be allowed to fly.